I am Joel Anderson with Equities.com. Uh, we're here at the 2014 Aegis Conference, and we're sitting down with Dr. Robert Ashton, who's the yes. Chief Medical Officer with Myos Corporation. Yes. Uh, trades under MYOS on the NASDAQ. Uh, so, Myos is doing a lot of really interesting work in, in biotherapeutics and specifically in, in the nutritional field. Uh, why don't you talk a little bit about that? Sure. Yeah. We, have a, we have a unique model. We have a uh, biotherapeutics division and a yeah. bionutritional division. Um, we focus on muscle health. So initially, our, our bionutritional product focuses on muscle, muscle health, which is important at any age, from you know, teenagers all the way through aging in terms of sarcopenia, loss of muscle as you age. Um, in addition, many chronic diseases have muscle wasting, cachexia, and yeah. many, many chronic diseases. So we have a bionutritional product that's available now. Individuals can take over the counter um, and take it daily. And this improves your muscle health in terms of muscle growth, size, lean body mass, strength, and conditioning. Um, yeah. At the same time, everything we learn from that, we're taking into the biotherapeutic realm understanding to, to go down the, the normal routes of a biotherapeutics type of company um, and all of the associated products and targets in muscle uh, in that division. Okay, can you talk a little bit about your product pipeline then? Sure, yeah. excuse me. Right now we have a um, bionutritional product with fortitropin, which is the active ingredient. Yep. Um, that is available in a simple powder form, um, soon to be in uh, different bars, different forms, drinks uh, that individuals are able to take. Uh, and that's, that's our main ingredient and we're, we're targeting the myostatin pathway. The biotherapeutics aspects of it, we're targeting not just the myostatin pathway, but the pathways around it, in addition to the inflammatory uh, markers and the inflammation that are associated with muscle diseases, because as you know, uh, you know higher in inflammatory markers and everything affect your muscle health and growth. And we're targeting through uh, a small molecule pipeline, Jack Three, right now, um, and targeting those pathways. Okay, absolutely. And so, in terms of what competitive edge or strategic advantage you think Myos is sort of bringing to the to the table. Um, what would you identify that as? Yeah. So I, I think this is unique because what happens is we have a product yeah. currently on the market available that many of the large pharma companies are going after. They have a long yeah. regulatory cycle, the seven to ten year. We have something right now that, uh, that can attack and treat muscle wasting diseases. Yeah. At the same time, we are able to then learn what we're doing in that to, to make the smaller molecules. So we, we are already developing solutions, and we have a solution to, to problems that everyone else is still working on. And I think that's what makes us unique. So one hand washing the other, really. Yeah. Uh, uh, absolutely. And, and what happens is, instead of uh, continuing down the pipeline, all of our bionutritional is a revenue generating. So yeah. that helps build our biotherapeutics division so that we can maximize you know, the, the investor money uh, and our own shareholder value. Absolutely. And so... Uh, what should the investing community be looking out for over the next 12 months in terms of important milestones for Myos? Absolutely. So we have uh, uh, other clinical trials that are right now. We're, we've uh, completed one in average, average males, um, and we're continuing the work in other areas in terms of females um, and in an older population. Um, at the same time, we're going to have a, uh, new, new products and new forms on the market uh, in the next six months. Okay. Sounds like an exciting time to be there. It, it, I think it's. I think this is a great time. It's definitely an inflection point for the company. Yeah. Uh, and so, do you have any additional closing comments that you'd like to make right now? No. I, I, again, I think that this is a, a unique model in the sense of having you know two pillars uh, instead of the traditional route of biotherapeutics, where you know it, it doesn't generate money and, and has long pipelines <laughs> with an unknown period of time, and you right. get to a phase three trial, and all of a sudden you realize it didn't work, and you put in you know hundreds of millions of dollars. We have we we have de-risked the biotherapeutics division yep. by creating the bionutritional division. I think that's incredibly unique um, and hopefully other people will recognize sort of this you know, two-pillar approach. Not a lot of early stage biotherapeutic companies that you can invest in that have revenue. Absolutely. Thank you very much. Uh, this has been Dr. Robert Ashton, Chief Medical Officer of Myos Corporation, which trades on the NASDAQ under the ticker symbol MYOS. Uh, my name is Joel Anderson with Equities.com uh, and thank you very much for watching.